You know what? <laughs> oh, wait. Because I'm going to be planting them in the back. So it doesn't matter if I can see. I'm going to go with Tangle Kelp. Because getting myself set up for, like, protection and stuff on the pool lanes was kind of a pain. And a tangle kelp. Oh yeah, sorry, that was my... I'm taking a drink of my... Or I was taking a drink of my pop in the middle of that. That's what the pause was for. This time, anyway. Because, you know, I stop and pause for no reason all the time. <laughs> Excuse me. What was I saying? Oh, brains. <clears throat> oh yeah, I was saying I'm going to be planting the cactus in the back because it shoots like a pea shooter in the fact that, or in the way, or in the sense that, you know, it'll shoot as soon as the thing comes onto the lane instead of right when they get close. Oh, there are two of them. You see, that's where the Zerg Rush might prove to be a little uh, problematic. Alright, so I think I've got that pretty well handled for right now. I'm gonna throw him right there. Throw you right there. Someone's eating something, and I don't know if it's just the cone head. Mm. Sunflower. Oh, I'm pretty sure it was just cone head there. Alright, so getting those jerks, or getting this back lane bottom, not back. I guess they, they're they in the back of the bottom lane, but you know. Alright, so he died before he could eat my shroom. I'm gonna unplant that one, and if nothing else... Oh god. Oh god. This is bad. This is really bad. This jerk is gonna get straight to my- oh no! Oh no! I'm about to eat some humble pie here. He's flying right- oh. Okay. I forgot that- I thought he was just gonna fly right by my pool sweeper, to be honest. Oh, and I don't have any Doom Shrooms, so I might actually have to deal with a, uh, um, large wave. I'm just gonna keep, like, enough for my cactus in my back pocket here, in the event that I, I, be I better set up, like, lily pads and stuff in case, especially if it happens on that one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put, in fact, I'm gonna put him right there. Oh god. I don't know why I'm setting up for a squash when I can just do that. Okay. Final wave. Alright, I see a jerk at the top. I'm gonna put a squash there though, because I don't think my kelp is gonna be ready. Oh. 
Aha, suck it. Now, blowovers are nice because they blow away balloon zombies and the fog. So, they have a dual efficiency here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep rolling with the cactus just because. Uh, what was it? Oh, yeah, walnuts. Walnuts are the other thing I need. Oh, dolphin rider zombies. Those guys. Wait, hold on, I might have enough to buy another seed. No, I don't. I only, I'm only about halfway there. Whoa. Alright. I'm just gonna, uh, I'm just gonna, oh no, okay, I messed that up, I messed that up big time. I think I, I think I have to squash that guy. So at the very least, I've got a walnut lid down to protect that row now. <clears throat> I hope that's not a cone in the fog there. Set down another sunflower. I'm gonna unplant that mushroom. I don't know if I've actually made any of my mushroom jokes on this playthrough, or if those are just things I've said in actual conversation. I can't remember anymore. Well, at the risk of sounding silly and repeating myself, why did everyone want to be friends with the mushroom? Because he was a fun guy. Why couldn't they have the party at the fun guy's house? Because there wasn't much room. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so stupid. Okay, I'm, the next time I get a enough, the next time I get a hundred, uh, yeah, there we go and be gone. Alright, so we can actually... The fog comes back if you have a blowover, but it's gone for long enough for you to do what you need to do. That's why it's cool. Like, I'm gonna set down a walnut there. Throw down a lily pad there, so I know that there's a walnut ready when it's ready there will be a walnut also it's gone long enough for the sunflowers to give you like enough sun to use the blower again yeah like I can get rid of this guy with extreme prejudice I'm gonna set up you and set you up there we go now we're talking. Mm. 
just scratch. Oh, this one wants to see some stuff. Okay, I'm gonna set up a lily pad there too. So that's ready when I want it to be. Actually, I'm gonna lay a trap with a squash on one of them. This guy's trying to be sneaky. Um, oh no. Both of my walnuts are pretty, or most of my walnuts have been pretty toasted, which isn't good. Evaluate who's in the most. Okay, this one is because, yeah. <clears throat> All right. Oh man, I didn't realize how fast the recharges on those were. Oh yeah, that's a little animation for the uh, cactus there, doing its thing. Alright, so we're gonna throw him there. And see, as opposed to just blowing them away, though, and taking them off your screen, the cactus still has to kill the balloon zombie. Uh oh I hope my sunflowers drop enough for me to just get rid of this jerk. There we go. If they're over top of the water, it does not break, or it doesn't drop them though, because it just straight up kills them. Because I guess the balloon zombies don't know how to swim. Who would have guessed? Who would who would have known? Oh no, there's there's a f dolphin zombie somewhere. That's not good. That's not good at all. I need some sun stat so I can uh there we go out of here I hear a lot of consumption noises I don't know I don't know how comfortable I am with that Those are the only two left, and they're either gonna die or they're gonna get squashed. Well, they're gonna die before I squash them, or they will be death by squash. There we go. Hmm. A taco? Oh, that's right. Level five. What are you going to do with a taco? You found my magic taco. I must have it, I'll give you a thousand dollars. Yes, the taco is mine. Why'd I give you so much for a taco? Because I'm crazy. <laughs> <laughs>